I'm Jessica. And I'm Riley. And we are Miley, Miley Made Me Do, do it. it. Hey y'all, this is your girl Jessica with Miley Made Me Do It. And I am here with a, I think this is the third series of the Salerno pattern. Um, last week, I, well a few weeks ago, I did the um, teardrop bodice and I did the bow bodice. Okay, so now we're going to do the other half of it. We're going to do the Salerno high-waisted skirt. So, you're in, oh, I've got a little, I'm also going to add some shorts to it, okay? So, this right here, this pattern is the new, I think it's the New Haven um, um, leggings. So, I made, I've got the shorties. I cut them the sizes she needed. Make sure that it's a size seven for my width. That's gonna be a size seven for my skirt. And of course, my my band here, my uh, high-waisted band. So, um, yeah, so I'm gonna add these skirts to the high-waisted, um, high-waisted skirt. I mean, I'm not the skirt, these mm -hmm. shorts to the high-waisted skirt. So, let's get started. Let me show you what I have. I have the, um, the waistband here. You're gonna have two here. And then here we got the skirt. Since I have directional fabric, I had to make sure I cut two of them. I couldn't do the double, the double um, fold. Okay, so I got to have to get two of those. All right, and then I have the, I have the um, shorts. Like I said, this is the New Haven shorties. Okay, so let's get started. All right. Well, first we're gonna start with our waistband here. Okay, so we're gonna take our waistband and we're gonna make it right sides together. Okay. We're gonna sew a, let's see what that seam allowance was. That was 3 8 inch. So we're gonna sew a 3 8 inch seam allowance on both sides right there. And then I'll show you what it looks like when I get back. All right, now let's construct our skirt. I have two pieces. For my skirt, what I'm gonna do is, it's probably too big, but um, too wide for it, but what I'm gonna do, I'm going to open it, and we're gonna right size together. That's one half of my skirt, and I am going to get the other half here, and we're gonna put those right size together. Right here. All right, and I'm going to pin and so a 3 8 inch seam allowance on this side of it, of my skirt here. All right, and then open the other side. Let's turn to this other side here and we're going to match the side seams. And I'm gonna pin And then I'm going to sew. All right. All righty. And I'll show you guys what that looks like. We're gonna sew here on the on the two side seams here. And I'll show you what that looks like when I get back. All righty. So now let's grab our shorties here. Um, when I cut my shorties, I did the waistband, the um, the yoga waistband version, okay? Instead of doing the elastic version, because since I'm using a waistband for my skirt, I just did the height of the waistband when I cut it. So we're gonna take them together, take them apart here, and we're gonna right size them together. Now, if you're not adding shorties, you don't have to do this section, this part. And we're going to match them up here at the crotch seam. And I believe this is a half inch seam allowance. If I'm, if I think it is, but if it's not, just go back and check your pattern and make sure. Okay. So we're going to crotch seam on that one. Bring this other one in here. Take it. And we're going to pin at the crotch seam. And we're going to sew, I believe, a half inch seam allowance on this one where the legs are. And I will show you what that looks like when I get back. Okay, so 
let's get our um, shorties here. And I have one turned right side out and one wrong side out. What I'm gonna do is I am going to take my shorty, the run with the wrong side out, and I'm going to put it, put the, the right side out inside of it, where it'd be right sides together here. I'm gonna match the crotch seam. And then I am going to just smooth this on out and pin. Also gonna sew a half inch seam allowance to attach. Okay, this U shape is what we're doing. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to take this to my machine and I am going to sew this U shape here. We're using a half inch seam allowance and then I will show you what that looks like when I get back. Okay, so our skirt is hemmed on both the side seams. So that's done and we'll put this to the side. And our waistband is done also. We're gonna put this to the side. So what I'm all right. So our shorties are done at the well, not all the way done, but kinda. Um you're gonna need to hem the bottom of it. I'm gonna do that last, but you make sure you just hem the bottom of your shorties, okay? So now let's bring in our skirt and waistband. Okay, so I have my skirt here. So what I'm going to do is, is I've already did little notches here on the side so I can have both my side seams. And I'm going to open up my skirt. You may or may not be able to see this depending on how big, how much, you know, how much I got. But we're going to open our skirt up. And we already have our side seams here. And we're going to match the shorty side seams to the, uh, other, you know, to the side seams of the skirt. Now, this is going to be my front. Now, if you have anything that you want to put on the back to make sure that's your back part of the skirt, you might need to do that right now. But since it's a whole circle skirt, you don't really have, you know, you figure it out. So let's get our shorties and put it inside. We're going to match the side seams here. And oh, as you can see, it's just the wrong side of the skirt touching the right side of the shorties. So let's pin all the way around. So I got that side hidden. And then this side, and we're just going to pin all the way around. Oh, I did make a notch here for my center. So I'm going to put that where my front side seam is, and we're going to hit it there and just match it up all the way around. If you would like to, you can base this on. I normally don't base this on. So, okay, we're gonna match that up. Boom. Here. And that, okay. Now, let's get our, now let's get our waistband. This is gonna probably be the hard part for me to try to make sure this waistband, when I have it flipped, it won't, <laughs> it won't be upside down. So if I put it this way and I flip it, it's gonna be right, it's gonna be up. So yeah, all right. So let's take our waistband and we're gonna match the side seams here. I'm gonna sandwich the skirt piece in. So boom, match the side over here. Boom, all right. And we're just going to use our waistband, make sure it's all matched up. And we're going to just attach our waistband to it. We'll pin our waistband to it.
sure. I forget this. Here. Alright, let's raise it out a little bit. Boom. Okay, so we're going to take this to our machine and we're going to sew a 3 8 inch seam allowance right here along the top. I'm going to serge mine and then I'll show you what it looks like when I get back. All right, and we are done. So uh, if you want to, you guys can go ahead and hem the bottom of your skirt piece here. Um, I have not did that just yet. And this is what the shorts look like under it. Just like that, you can go ahead and hem your shorts and stuff. And that is it. I think it's super cute. All righty. So if you haven't yet, subscribe to my channel. This was the Serleno um skirt high waisted skirt pattern so you guys can go check that out i will have the pattern in the description and just go you know <laughs> get them watch hours up for your girls so this was super easy super cute thank you guys so much for watching see ya